Hello to all. The sermon that I'm about to read to you is taken from www.jrfsitting.org, which is written by High Priestess Maxine. A history of the Baphomet. The origin of the name Baphomet is not clear. It appears to be a combination of two Greek words, Bathe and Metis, <coughs> meaning absorption of knowledge. Other authors claim it is a corruption of Mohammed, Mohammed, uh, or Mohammed, but the first definition seems to be more accurate. Baphomet has its origins in the goat of Mendes. <coughs> Baphomet was also one of the Alices, sorry, can I pronounce it, of Alister Crowley. Baphomet has also been called the goat of Mendes and the and the black goat. The goat also has to do with fertility and, and symbol of the magnum opus of alchemy when one's energies from Kundalini increase. Spiritual alchemy is of ancient Egypt and is the transformation of the human soul into the Godhead. This is, comp co this is completing our creator God Satan's work. The most famous historical account of Baphomet began with the Knights Templar. The Baphomet at the time of the Templars was believed to be an idol represented by a human soul, a stuffed human head and a metal or wooden head with curly black hair, or sometimes a black cat. The idol was said to be worshipped by the Knights Templar in the latter days as the source of fertility and wealth. The Knights Templars, also known as the Poor Knights of Christ, was founded in the year 1118 by Hug de Pains of, Chanth of Champagne, France. Sorry, can I pronounce it? The order began with nine or eleven men who were sent to the Holy Land to dig beneath the Temple of Solomon for several European families of wealth who had claimed to certain artifacts buried there before it was destroyed in 17 CE. The order took on on the oath of asceticism, ce celibacy, sorry, can I pronounce it, devotion to the Catholic Church and poverty. They were forbidden ownership of any personal poverty. Any wealth accorded by the order was to be shared in common. When excavating beneath the temple, the knights discovered gold and ancient relics and also many scrolls. Shortly, shortly thereafter, magnificent Magnificent uh, cathedrals and other buildings sprung up all over the Europe. Most of the Gothic Gothic demons are known for their expert expertise in architecture, and there are legends claiming many bridges and buildings in Europe were built by Satan and his demons. The true meaning of the Temple of Solomon is the Temple of the Sun. Sol, Om, and On are all wo words for the Sun. Sol is the Latin word for the Sun and is close to the English world, uh, word. Sorry, word Sol. Om is the name given by the Hindus to the spiritual Sun, and On is, a, is an Egyptian word for Sun. The symbolism of the Temple of Solomon was stolen and made into an actual character, as with the fictitious Nazarene and nearly everything in the Judeo Christian Bible. Templars uh, were eventually appointed to protect the Holy Land and keep it from the Muslims during the wars of the Crusades. The order, gr or the order grew, grew into the thousands and groups were organized throughout Europe, but France remained their stronghold. There still depicts two men riding on one horse uh, because in the early history of the order the knights could not afford afford a horse each. During their journeys to and from the Holy Land in the Middle East, they encountered many different peoples. It is possible they learned of the goat of Mendes as the Muslims kept records and had knowledge of the history of ancient Egypt where the goat of Mendes originated. The Templars grew in both size and wealth, reaching their peak in the 4th century. The in the 14th century, the ending of the wars of the Crusades did not have any impact on the order as they used the uh, oppor opportunity to travel and enter into commerce and mo money lending. They established a very pr profitable business relationship with the enemy in times of truce. The order accumulated vast wealth and power. 
They eventually became the victims of both the greedy Catholic Church that was aware of their forbidden knowledge and King Philip IV of France, who was said to be heavily in debt and owed the, and owned, owed the order a considerable sum. From what I have researched, it appears the real reason <coughs> the temporal the Templar order was persecuted by the Catholic Church was for their occult knowledge and power they obtained from excavating beneath the temple of, uh, at, the day, at the Dome of the Rock. This power brought them vast wealth as it is supposed to do for those who have it and knowledge on how to use it. Philip IV, uh, Philip IV plotted along with Pope uh, Clement Fifth to destroy the order. October third, third, thirteen seven, Philip IV had Grand Master Jacques de Molay and four one hundred one hundred forty other knights arrested in the Paris Temple. More arrests followed throughout France. The temples were subjected to torture and masse. The Catholic Church, with its inquisitors, accused them of devil worship, blasphemy, sodomy, and idolatry. There was a secrecy surrounding their meetings, and wild rumors spread concerning bizarre invitations, rituals, and did much to promote public suspicion of the order. Under torture, members of the of the order admitted to renouncing the Nazarene, spitting, trampling, and urinating of on the crucifix, engaging in intercourse with demons, indulging in sexual perversity, and to worshipping the idol of Baphomet. Many of the temples were burned at the stake and murdered by the Inquisition, the most noted being Grand Master Jacques de Molay. After being in prison and tortured for seven years, he was burned alive at the stake. The Shroud of Turin was of the blood and blood and body f flutes of Jack Lewis de Molay as he was led, laid on a soft feather bed to recover from more torture from the Catholic Inquisitors. Upon close examination, it is obvious given the position of the body. The top part is, sh um, top is shown there. You can read the sermon. I'm not gonna. There is no way this was the Nazarene. The shroud was also inspected by several diverse scholars who proved beyond any doubt. Given the material and uh, constants, the item was no older than the 12th century. The Catholic Church, being the prophetic uh, liar that it is, continues to scam people to this day. I would also like to add uh, in revising this article in light of new knowledge. Christianity appears to have manifest with the Inquisition. It is nowhere near as old as the, the 2,000 years they claim it to be. History is and has been rewritten re 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 with lies, while being destroyed at the same time. A very blunt example is what is now and has been occurring in Iraq. What we have been indoctrinated to believe in history class is not necessarily the truth. Ancient relics and architecture speak for the for themselves in addition history was written and told by the winners of every war remember there are always two sides to every archant one side is, is usually the only one that is heard along with per permissible opinions only along with a shroud of Turin lie the Nazarene is fictitious and was learned from an academic concept of a working which had its origin in some 18 plus pagan gods such as Odin who hung from tree and said who was crucified on the Furka, Osiris who died and was resurrected, etc. Many pagan gods have been passed off as the Nazarene such as Apollo images by the hundreds of pagan gods are now labeled as the Nazarene. This is not this is no different from the Christi Christianization of pagan holidays such as e Easter of Astarot, the Yule, which originated uh, had nothing whatsoever to do with the fictitious Nazarene, of which Ixen Fundis are now weeding out the pagan traditions and replacing them with lies, as they have done with pagan temples which were destroyed and 
had extended George's blood directly over them. Before he was murdered at the stake, uh, Molay cursed, uh, cursed both uh, the Pope and the King and predicted the death of both within the year. Both did die within the time per period. The Baphomet evolved over the centuries. The most widely known uh, representation of the Baphomet is the drawing by 19th century French magician Eliphas, Eliphas Levy called the Baphomet of Mendes. Levy combined the images of the Tower Devil card and the he goat worshipped in the city of Mendes in ancient Egypt. It is unclear where, whether the ancient Egyptian woman had intercourse with a goat during religious rites for fertility, but the Catholic Church claimed this, and this is more than likely where the notion that a devil had intercourse with this witches came from. The Levi Baphomet is very similar to the Egyptian Akhenaten, which is both female and which is both male and female. Sorry. Uh, note the male and female features of the body and the serpentine facial features, which symbolize the serpent Kundalini, portraying the hermaphrodite, which is symbolic of merging the male and female aspects aspects of the soul, the Ida and the Pingala, and achieving the Godhead. The monotheism is another allegory, as the gods are in many ancient writings code words for the chakras of the soul, and when one works to achieve the Godhead of the Magnum, sorry, of the Magnum Opus, all of the, all of the ch chakras are transformed and united into gold. Yoga is a branch of alchemy, and the word yoga means union. This is the unifis unification of the soul. Levi's famous drawing of Baphomet depicts male, female image representing the dualistic nature of life. Female breast and he and the phallus, one arm masculine, the other feminine, one arm pointing up and the other pointing down, representing the hermetic, the hermetic principle of as above as so below. The image uh, continued to evolve over the years. Anton, Anton Levy spotted an illustration in the book A Pictural History of Magic and the Supernatural. Supernatural, sorry, wait. Supernatural by Makurai Ma Maurice Bessie. Uh, copyright 1961, English edition, copyright 1964. This was the first known published work where the goat-headed pentagram was surrounded by two circles and included the Hebrew letters reading Leviathan, Le Leviathan, sorry, I cannot pronounce it. The names Samuel and Lilith were also included in this depiction. Leviathan, also known as Cthulhu, is a name for the Kundalini serpent. Anton Levy eliminated the Samuel and Lilith and decided this particular symbol best represented the Church of Satan and made it the Church logo in 1967. Because of the Hebrew lettering and the circles which are highly offensive to Satan and his demons, Joss Ministries had, has removed them and replaced them with a cuneiform script reading Satan. The sign of Capricorn symbolized by the goat represents the new winter sun being reborn again as the days get longer. The goat is one of Satan's sacred animals. In the 5th century BCE, uh, Herodotus reported that the people of Mendes in the Nile Delta venerated all goats, particularly male ones. For the Greeks and Romans, the goat represented fertility. Goats are fertile and known to be lusty. The city of Mendes reached its curtal peak when the Ram God was worshipped, uh, whom the Greeks later equipped with Pan. Pan was known as the as, as a satyr. Satyrs had the horns, legs, hoofs, and beards of goats. Pan's symbol was the phallus, and he was invoked for the fertility of the flocks or an abundant hunt. He then tended flocks and danced through the woods playing his panpipes, uh, which he invented as the lusty leaders of satyrs. 
he chased the nymphs. The goat, sometimes as sometimes a ram was used, was the master of fertility and was celebrated as copulator in Anap and inseminator in the district of Mendes, where women were blessed with children. During ritual, rituals, women danced naked before the image. The Order of Nine Angels claims another perspective to Baphomet. 7,000 years ago, a civilization known as Albion had uh, various rites associated with a dark goddesses who, were, who was known as Baphomet. References The Second Messiah, Templars, the Turin Shroud, and the Great Secret of Freemasonry by Christopher Knight and Robert Lomas, published Shaftesbury, Dorset, Boston, Element, 1997, Witchcraft, Magic, and Alchemy by Grillot de Givry, 1931, translated into English, 1971, Chapter, uh, chapter 9. Involuntary dem demoniacs. The Encyclopedia of Witches and Witchcrafts, a uh, witchcraft by Rosemary Ellen Gooley, copyright 1989. Entries on Baphomet, pages 21, 22, and Knights Templar, pages 186, 187. Castle Dictionary of Witchcraft by David Pickering, copyright 1996, entries on Baphomet, page 11, Knights, of, Knights Templar, page 161, uh, Secrets of Western Sex Magic by Frater Udi, copyright 2001, The Ritual of the Goat of Mendes, page 192, At the Heart of Darkness Witchcraft, Black Magic and Satanism Today by John Parker, copyright 1993, page, page two, 202. Luf Lucifer Rising by Gavin Badley, copyright 1999, page 164. The Sinister da Dialectic. Lamas Celebrating the Fruits of the Harvest by Anna Franklin and Paul Ma Mason. Copyright 2001, article on the GOAT, page 166. Thank you for listening and hail safe.